I'm Missy. I'm Molly. I'm drawn to Molly for so many different reasons. Uh, she's caring, she's giving, uh, she's genuine. Uh, our friends think that she's one of the sweetest people around, and I love that about her. Uh, she's intelligent. Uh, she always kind of pushes me to be uh, better with uh, coming up with answers. She's like, think outside the box, be creative. Because I ask a lot of questions throughout the day. Um, and in today's world, uh, people are always on the go. You know, they don't stop and engage. And one of the things I admire or appreciate about Molly is that she stops to connect, whether it be with family or friends or someone at the grocery store or a gas station. And she's like, How's your day going? How are you doing? And that's even before she even asked for something that she's looking for. <laughs> and uh, so I just, I really appreciate that. And uh, I can't wait to be a parent with her. What I appreciate most about Missy is her sense of adventure. She's always planning fun trips for us, whether it's, you know, to the mountains and going snowboarding with friends for the weekend or planning the next big trip to, to go out of the state or out of the country. She just makes our life uh, so much fun and so exciting and I appreciate how genuine and honest she is. Her friends and family just, um, I don't know, when Missy walks into a room, people are instantly uh, comfortable around her and I love that about her and she's taught me to make sure that I say I love you to all my friends and family and so often after, at the end of a phone call, I'll say I love you and it just feels good. She started that <laughs> tradition or I admire that, um, that she taught me that. And she's absolutely amazing. I appreciate everything about her. I think we feel like open adoption kind of resonates with us because of, uh, in particular with me, I'm a very inquisitive person and my friends kind of laugh at me because I have question games, I ask questions throughout the day at work or in our social lives and, you know, I feel like I've always been appreciated for that in the sense of just having the kind of the free freedom for doing that. And I think that with, or we think that with open adoption, that really connects with what everybody needs in it. And as far as a child with the birth parents, the adoptive parents, um, that our child would feel free to ask questions no matter what time of their life, from a youth to a teenager to, you know, even in their 20s, 30s, that they should have the, the ability to ask a question about who they, who they are, where they came from, and, you know, kind of where their life is kind of headed. And so we really like that about the open adoption. Yeah. We, uh, yeah, an open adoption is really important for us for all the great reasons that Missy mentioned. And just to, um, I think it's the most natural and it just makes the most sense for all parties involved and mainly for the child to have access to answers for all the questions that they might have. And then they have that many more um, loved ones rooting for them and looking for the, hoping that they have the best life possible and helping them make the best life possible. And for the birth parents, I think it's great. Um, since I, I was adopted through a closed adoption and I would love nothing more to be able to tell my birth parents, hey, it turned out okay, I'm happy, I'm healthy, I've had this great life and thank you so much for, you know, making a selfless decision. And, um, I think open adoption allows for that conversation and it's just, we're big fans, it's awesome.